Hello, I'm Michael Dworing and with Wojciech Kiewza and Arkady Żurawski would like to present our case report. Developmental dysplasia of the hip joint is one of the most common congenital defects and often results in functional and structural disorders. Such cases particularly demand optimizing therapeutic effects and maximally reducing the duration of therapy. The aim of this case report is to present the therapeutic process in a child with developmental hip dysplasia. This case report of the female child born with sublocation of the left hip joint. The treatment was the Volta method. During the six weeks of Volta treatment, the left half of the femoral head was centralized and the process of formation of the hip joint acetabulum was influenced effectively enough to change the acetabulum graft type from the baseline D to, to B after 4 to 1 days of treatment. Our conclusions are the therapeutic workup of congenital hip joint dysplasia should involve, apart from a neonatologist and pediatrician, also a physiotherapist who will investigate the child's neuromuscular coordination. The therapy of a disorder of hip joint development of neuromotor origin should involve the application of global patterns according to Voita. Children with congenital dysplasia of the hip joint should commence rehabilitation as early as possible. Thank you very much.